Before we get into the video people, I am giving away 11,500 Apex coins every single month. To be in with a chance of winning them, make sure you are subbed to this channel and have that bell notification button ticked. Drop a like on the video and leave a comment down below. More details are in the video description. What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel and I appreciate you being here. Today I bring you another Apex Legends video and today guys I bring you exclusive news on 6 new weapons believed to be coming to the game. Well actually after these recent leaks, well it's kinda undeniable now. Okay so we have seen numerous weapons within the game files to Apex Legends. Many data miners have pulled out names like the car SMG, the Vault SMG and many others. But deep down we have always known that Apex is built on the same game Titanfall is or was. Meaning that many of Titanfall's old game files can still be found within the files of Apex Legends. Luckily enough though we know and understand this, so we also know when such files get updated or removed. So if files do indeed get updated with patches it's more or less a certain that these files are still being worked on or considered for the game. So after the recent update that landed with the Battle Pass and Season 1, many files were indeed updated, some we expected, others we didn't, and we also saw the inclusion of new files. Surprisingly, we started seeing more weapons from Titanfall, some anti-Titan weapons and others reformed. But even then, seeing these weapons such as the car SMG, which was a great Titanfall weapon, many people still believe these are still old Titanfall files. Now before we get into the files and weapons found which in my opinion proves these weapons are being worked on for the future of Apex Legends, let's firstly check out the weapons found so far which are important for this video. Firstly, big shout out to Apex Leaks News for bringing this news to light. His Twitter can be found linked within the video description. Okay, so the weapons to look at are, firstly we have the Archer. This I will add, the blue colouring is due to no texture being added to the weapon. It's nothing unfamiliar for data mine files and images to appear like this. Now this weapon for sure looks a lot like an anti-vehicle or titan weapon, that's because it is. Remember we saw Launcher's data mined ages ago, long before season 1 was even released. Next up we have the car SMG, a weapon from the world of Titanfall, a weapon which while well, although classed as an SMG, it felt more like an assault rifle due to its slower than normal SMG rate of fire. Great for controlled close range hits. Next up we have the Defender, which you may know was another anti-Titan weapon from Titanfall. This in Titanfall though was called the Charge Rifle. Now its part of play in Apex at the moment is not yet known. Next up we have the ERG. Now the ERG-1 was in Titanfall and classed as a Grenadier weapon. Single fire direct energy propelled launcher, sounds cool. Next up we have the Softball, another grenade launcher type weapon from Titanfall. Within Titanfall though this was called the R6P Softball. And lastly guys we have the Vault SMG, another weapon which first appeared in the world of Titanfall. So I know what you guys are thinking, these are just old Titanfall files still within the game files for Apex Legends. Yes, I thought that too, but guys, new evidence suggests otherwise, and that these weapons will be coming to Apex Legends sooner or later. So on screen now we see all 6 weapons, but with files found attached. And for each and every one of these weapons guys, we see audio files which tie them to Apex Legends. On the Archer for instance, we see dialogue for Octane who was introduced in Season 1. For the Archer, we see dialogue MP which is multiplayer, Octane ping. So these audio files for Octane pinging these weapons are in the game. Now you could say if this was a legend like Bloodhound or Wraith that these are old files and were probably scrapped. But the point these are all Octane audio files, audio files for a legend introduced in Season 1, it does make you wonder. But we are also seeing Octane ping audio files for the Defender, the Softball, the Car SMG, the EPG and the Vault SMG. So you gotta ask yourself, why would there be audio files for a new legend in Octane pinging such weapons if they are old, leftover Titanfall files? That just doesn't add up. But then you have the question of, why would there be anti-Titan weapons in a game with no Titans? Well people, as we have seen in the past, Titans have been tied to Apex Legends. Not long ago we saw leaked audio files for Pathfinder pinging Titans, Reapers and even Stalkers. So there still could be a possibility that we will see Titans sometime in the future. I mean if Titans were to come, I'd say they'll come with some limited time mode. And it's there and then I believe we will see weapons such as the anti-Titan weapons we've seen today. As they just wouldn't fit into the normal battle royale mode in my opinion. I mean the Vault SMG and the Car SMG probably would. The ERG probably would. 
and probably a grenade launcher, but anti-titan weapons I just see no place for. But without titans in the game, some of these just do not make sense. So I'm going to do a little bit more research guys and let you guys know my discoveries. But on that note, we have come to the end of the video guys. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really does help out. If you are new around here and enjoy daily Apex Legends videos, be sure to subscribe. And if I never want to miss a video, I upload it can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.